Bajabi Amila, tops list of contenders for Tudumbu's chief of staff. Welcome to the news and please subscribe to our channel to get, to get notified when we post our juicy news updates. Please click on the notification bell. Speaker of the House of Representatives, Honorable Femi Bajabi Amila is the leading candidate for the post of chief of staff to President-elect Bola Metunambu in the next administration. Bajabi Amila was copiously missing at the International Conference Center, ICC, Abuja on Wednesday when the Independent National Electoral Commission and a presented certificates to return of return rather to elected members of the tenth House of Representatives. Wajabamila was re elected to represent Surulir one federal constituency in Lagos for the sixth consecutive tenure during the February twenty fifth presidential and national assembly elections. He polled 19,717 votes to defeat his closest opponent, Bosun Jeje, of the People's Democratic Party, who polled 5,121 votes. Leadership Friday, however, gathered that the Speaker may eventually not represent his constituency in the 10th Assembly, as he is likely to be considered for the position of the Chief of Staff to the President elect, Asiwaju Bola Ahmed Tunubu, in the new government. The source familiar with Bajabi Amila confirmed that the speaker being one of Tunubu's core loyalists and having worked with politicians from every federal constituency in Nigeria in the last 20 years is more likely to be considered for the plum job. When asked if Bajabi Amila will abandon his fresh mandate to pursue the chief of staff job in Tunubu's government, the source said this is what we are hearing. If you notice, he did not come for a certificate of return on Wednesday. The truth is he does not need that certificate. He has everything to function optimally as the chief of staff to the president in the new government. He has worked with politicians in every federal constituency and across political divides in the last 20 years. When contacted the special advisor to the speaker on media and publicity, Mr. Larry Lassisi said his principal was not able to attend his presentation of the certificate ceremony. He, however, declined further comments on the matter. He was just not able to be in Abuja for the ceremony, Lassisi said. Bajabi Amila was first elected to the House of Representatives in 2003. Since then, he has won election in the subsequent five election cycles. During his 20-year journey in the House of Representatives so far, Bajabi Amila served as Minority Whip, Minority Leader and Majority Leader before he was elected as Speaker in 2019. Hmm. <laughs> okay, they never, uh, what's it called? A lot, uh, grabbing of position nine day now. Grab your copy now if you can lay your hand on any position. That is what this government is all about. That is it. Once a new government is coming in, you will see the old ones that will fizzle out. Small, small now. The Buhari's relevance is on the drop. Small, small. Until they finally hand over. Until they finally hand over to the people. Uh, what's it called? To the president elect. He's qualified looking at his CV, but please let's, let's finish the court. Let's finish in the court first. Okay. Well, I mean, people say I've failed to be the courts. Remember that Mira Dili, your partner in crime at the Supreme Court, has retired. So no more biased treatment to the Supreme Court. Again, Tunubu could be sworn in as president if you're not in favor. If you're not in favor of you, it might as well relocate. I don't understand. <laughs> really? We are really joking with the people's mandates. Uh, can, uh, what's it called? Mandates. Well, my dear, at this point in time, I don't know what else to say than, like I've said, pray for the best, expect the worst. Put your mind that anything will happen. You know, expect really, really low. Really, really low. As in, let your expectation be so low, so that when it happens, it becomes like a surprise to you. This is what I'm going to say. I swear, also Fulani is better than Yibo tribe. I don't understand. Why are you coming out to say this? We shall be in for a tribal government you did. You still not understand who a chief of staff is. A chief of staff is somebody who is close to you. That's all I know, Sha. You're supposed to be very close to that person. So respect President Tunebu to appoint his chief of staff from House of Furani Ibo. I don't understand. Has anybody said that? Has anyone done that in Nigeria? Like I said, the chief of staff is supposed to be close to you. Okay? Go to some choose those you feel are capable to turn things around for better. In any election, there will be, there'll be winners and there will be losers. The losers will definitely cry foul, forgetting that both Senate and House of Rep are held in the same polling booth. And no cry on that except that of the President. Almighty God is with you, BAT. 
Do not be distracted. God will definitely direct your actions in Jesus' name. Okay. Mr. Bajabiamila will be a poor choice of the chief of staff to the president. Mr. Fashila's son, by comparison, will be a very good choice for the job. Hmm. Well, you never hear from Mr. Fashola. Mr. Fashola has not come out to say he's contesting for the post. But whatever be it may, we'll find out. Obi we'll goes to court. Some Labour Party House of Reps went to court to collect the certificate of return. Obi keeps okay. Some Labour Party House of Reps went to collect the certificate of return. Obi keeps complaining. How is he complaining? Is he still on the on the same court issue or which one? So on a normal level, Femi Bajabiamela is supposed to, as in your chief of staff, if you're the president elect, you're supposed to have an ally. Not be ally with a snitch. <laughs> I like better I like your chief of staff is supposed to be somebody you trust. So and Femi Bajabiami like he has been able to maintain that relationship for very long. Though Fashola will not be bad, but <laughs> Fashola then go put up another department where you work well, when to be chief of staff. Uh, no 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 no. Mm -hmm. When it comes to chief of staff, you need your very strong right hand man. Honorary Bajamela is a f good fit for that job. At the House of Reps, he can no longer be the speaker because the speakership will be zoned out of the Southwest and that will be demeaning to him to be a floor member in an institution that he has once headed. Hmm. All right. Um, how will this presidential election will be reconducted? Obi would have seen serious shock on how he will lose woefully. Hardly will he make the state again. His campaign brought religion and tribal sentiment. Obi can never be president. This is far from the truth. Far from it. Bad news. Are we really going to allow the crowds of Agbaris to move in? Are we really going to reward corruption, result, relocation, voter suppression, and rigging? My dear, <laughs> the matter still they cut. If if we enter streets now, for other countries, something happened in the enter streets. But if we enter streets now, now that time they go remember, you see these army people, people who say they never even fire bullets for their life, they will come use some people practice. The right time you go see them give order, may they come practice. Before you know, people go for, and that is what we don't want. I've said it. And I've been saying it from the beginning, you know, from the beginning game, that we don't want any justice for anybody after election. Everything should go smoothly. I beg. Make everybody calm down. Keep your I know it is painful. Sincerely, I know it is painful. Most of most especially those who gave their resources. Everybody gave their all this election. I'm telling you, those who use their resources, those who, you know, their time, those who even moved, go pay for hotel, make them for their closer to their polling units. And this thing happened to them. It's painful, but keep your muscles in check. 